This is how my Wednesday morning is looking so far at five days out from the NAB of Britain. Purely because I wasn't very well last night during the night. So I'm pretty drained. But I'm about to go and hit, get my breakfast and get my day started. It's going to be a toughie. Um, today I have a rest day from kind of craziness. And that just means that I've got like a chilled day from work. Uh, for me it's still not a rest day. Uh, I've got a website development meeting this morning with uh, my website company. Got some exciting things coming up for that and it will all be done through this channel as well. So you'll be able to get some access to that in the next coming months. Then I am going to go and do my cardio. I'm going to train. I'm just going to train biceps, triceps, abs I think today because I've not to train legs. Then tomorrow will be a rest and then Friday I'll do a, like a depletion pump session. Um, then this afternoon I'm doing like the girly things, getting my nails done and stuff for the show. And then this evening I've got my normal classes. So three classes tonight. I've got, uh, what day is this? Wednesday. I've got fat burn extreme to start off with. Then I've got some kettlebells and then I've got pound fit. So I love a Wednesday. It's midweek. It's hump day. So normally I've trained glutes, but not today, not this week. Sleepy. So I've just finished the um, web development meeting with Nexus, uh, the web print and marketing agency. So I'm just going to head now and go to the gym. But I just want to show you all the stairs that I had to walk up to get here. When you're on prep, that is a hell of a lot of steps, and a lot of stairs, and a lot of energy, used, wasted, knackered. I would also like to point out how tired I look in this video, uh, probably because I didn't get much sleep last night from not feeling very well. Um, I feel a little bit better now, so hopefully as the day goes on, I start to feel a little bit, like a wee bit more energy, and I might have to have a little kind of monster. love this bit of show prep. It is time for her to get the nails done. Taking care of. This is time to get these done and time for Sunday's show. Girly stuff. I've just finished getting my nails done and I've came out and this is the gorgeous view that I've been greeted with. Really, really don't think I appreciate enough where I live and how gorgeous it is. So I'm going to go to Aldi's and get some food for tomorrow's rest day meals. But I'm also considering going to Iceland and getting some post-show treats. Mm, ice cream sandwiches. Aldi's, Iceland's. Stick to Aldi's. I've got to laugh because I've just been to Aldi and while I was there I collected some of my carbs that I need for Friday's carb up because I thought oh, do you know, I may as well get them today so I don't have to come back tomorrow and I needed to buy 300 grams of sweet potato 
and it's quite good because they do loose sweet potatoes in there so you can buy individual ones and normally in supermarkets they have those little scales that you can weigh them on which are great because then you don't have to buy more than you need although you can't obviously cut up the potatoes in half in the shop but you can get a rough guide look at the size of this sweet potato I mean it's like the size of my head but what I'm laughing at is when I was in the shop I was contemplating do you think this is 300 grams? do you think that's enough? Steph, I think that is enough sweet potato it's absolutely massive excited so I've actually got a mega sweat on from that cardio because I had to run I had to run the last bit of the cardio because you don't think about it but when you're out walking sweating there's no toilets and when you're water loading drinking like six seven litres of water you need to go to the toilet quite often I kind of wish that we could just sunbathe together you loving the sunshine you're so cute. Okay, I know this is completely ridiculous, but I've actually just googled how to cook asparagus because I've never cooked it before and I've just read the back of the packet as well to see what I have to do with it. Here goes nothing. Well, I cooked it and it turned out awesome. I really liked it. This is the end result, a clean plate. Bonus to this asparagus.